Over the last few years, uh, Nike and Sakai had a few very nice collaborations and for sure this one will not disappoint. Yes guys, today we're gonna have a look at uh, both color combinations, so let's go ahead and take them out of the box. So the first one today guys will be this uh, British tan colorway. Because this time I actually was quite lucky, I managed to take also the second one. So let's take them out of the box as well. Okay guys, so the second one today will be this uh, iron grey color combination. As I've said previously guys, uh, I haven't won anything on the sneakers app for a few months now and I really thought that this time would be no different but for some reason I've actually managed to take both of them As you know this is a collaboration between Nike and uh, Sakai and uh, we actually had few releases from these uh, two big brands uh, this year with the uh, Ripper Waffle uh, we also had this Blazer Low released few months ago in um, some other color combination and materials. But this time we had this uh, two color combination released at the same time here in UK for a retail price of uh, 110 pounds. And they were actually released uh, on the last day of uh, July. When this collaboration uh, between Nike and Sakai uh, is taking place, uh, you need uh, to be prepared for uh, uh, two tongs, two sushes, two pair of laces and a crazy design for the midsole. And uh, as you can see, this one, uh, it's just that. For this uh, blazer low, uh, uh, this time we have this uh, suede material. As you know, uh, in June when we had the uh, other release, uh, we had uh, the leather material throughout. This time they decided to use this uh, suede and it actually looks and feels quite nice. And uh, besides this uh, suede used uh, mainly throughout uh, all of this shoe, we're gonna also have some um, leather accents uh, which will be uh, uh, here at the lacing system for this eyelet and also here for the double sushes and uh, of course we're gonna have uh, double laces but uh, in the actual uh, box Nike it's also providing uh, these uh, rope style laces in this white color so for each pair as you can see we have uh, two color combination for these laces and of course uh, underneath these laces we're gonna have uh, uh, two uh, tongs uh, the first being in this uh, suede material which actually it's a bit thicker and stiffer than the one underneath it which is actually very soft but both of them have uh, some uh, foam material so uh, all together they will actually feel quite nice so as you can see the first tongue will be in this uh, leather material where we also have uh, the Nike Sports wear uh, tagging but as you can see for this British tan uh, on the actual tag it's actually saying uh, made in Vietnam while uh, for this uh, iron grey it's actually saying made in China so I think that's a bit strange to have them made in uh, separate factories but uh, I don't mind it either way and uh, as you can see the second tongue will be uh, slightly different in this uh, nylon material uh, and uh, they also have a very nice foam material underneath so this one uh, will embrace your foot uh, quite nice and of course at the top of it we have the Nike Sakai tagging and as you can see here on the lateral side uh, uh, on top of this suede we're gonna have this uh, double uh, swooshes in uh, different colors 
and as you can see this uh, tongue uh, actually feels that uh, it's as long as the mid version of this uh, Sakai blazer which were released I think last year so as you can see here at the ankle section this shoe actually feels that someone cut it off and uh, you can see the actual uh, foam exposed and uh, when I actually uh, saw this shoe I was afraid that uh, this ankle section will actually be quite uh, uncomfortable but uh, this one being in this uh, foam uh, material which is actually quite soft uh, it doesn't bother me at all and as you go inside you can see that we have uh, a very nice lining and as I've said uh, this foam material is actually uh, very soft and very squishy so uh, it's embracing my ankle quite nicely and I didn't feel that uh, it's uh, uncomfortable at all inside we're gonna have this uh, white uh, foam insole which has the Nike and Sakai lettering on it and I actually felt that uh, these shoes are actually a bit more comfortable than your usual uh, blazer and uh, as we go here at the uh, heel section you can see that we have a lot of uh, layers of this uh, texturized material so uh, for sure uh, this uh, this section here is actually giving you a very nice support overall even though uh, it's just there for the aesthetics and uh, now we're gonna go to this uh, a very impressive uh, rubber midsole which as you can see it has a lot of layers so these layers were actually uh, being put on top of your usual blazer um, midsole and as you can see it has a very nice texture to the actual uh, material and uh, here at the front it also covers uh, a bit of the actual toe section so for sure this one is actually giving you a very good support and protection in the same time and uh, now we're gonna finish with this uh, of course rubber outsole which is uh, your usual uh, a blazer outsole but you can actually uh, see the different layers uh, being put off, uh, on top of your actual uh, blazer outsole so uh, uh, here at the heel section it's actually quite impressive they put a uh, few of them as in for the actual sizing I went with my true to size and uh, I feel that this one is actually uh, quite good but uh, you need to keep in mind that this uh, shoe is actually a bit longer and a bit uh, narrow and uh, for sure if you have wider feet I would definitely suggest you to go with a half size up and overall guys uh, I really like this uh, blazer low uh, in both uh, color combination but uh, I think I actually decided which one I uh, like more and it's gonna be this British uh, tan but overall they both look nice the color combination actually feel uh, quite premium I really like this uh, combination between this suede and leather throughout and uh, of course uh, Nike and Sakai never disappoints uh, I would say for a reasonable price I mean 110 pounds doesn't feel as much for a Sakai collaboration where you have very good materials and the shoe it's uh, I would say comfortable enough so uh, yes guys, uh, this was my uh, unboxing and reviewing of this uh, Nike Blazer and Sakai in this uh, British tan color combination and we also had the iron grey color combination as well. I really hope uh, you've enjoyed this video and if you did don't forget to press the like button and you also subscribe to the channel. And as always, I will see you in my next one. Thanks for watching.